Okay, so this is to explain auto scroller strats for Shaka and Ixion. So basically for phase two, when his health bar first goes up, he doesn't actually start attacking right away. He just kind of sits there doing nothing for a few seconds. So you can start phase two right next to him, fire off your alt fire if you have a good one, and go right into melee strats. Then after a couple of seconds, he will lift his blue glowing tentacle arm and start sending out the first auto scroller attacks then. So basically, if you jump when he lifts his arm, you can avoid the first auto scroller attacks. The timing is a little bit tricky, but if you do it just right, you can no hit phase two auto scroller. Then for phase three auto scroller, it's different. When his health bar first goes up in phase three, he starts sending out the auto scroller attacks right away. It isn't delayed like in phase two. So for phase three, it's better to start off a little bit further from Ixion. Um, and then when his health bar goes up, you can fire off your alt fire if you have a good one and jump dash over the first wave of auto scroller attacks to get next to him and go into melee strats. I usually still end up taking a hit during this auto scroller, but at least um, that avoids damage during the first cycle of it and minimizes the hits. A uh, quick note, of course you want to try to stay away from his sword arm while you melee because it does massive contact damage. So yeah, if I don't mess up, I will try to demonstrate. This is phase two. I'm also not the best at shotgun Ixion, so this phase two is going to be slow. Phase three, starting back a little bit. And yeah, that's how you do auto scroller shotgun Ixion.